right, good morning. It is now Sunday. Um, we've been working on our kitchen, which I'll get to in just a second. But on Friday we went out, we like bought some stuff that we needed because we needed like a big trowel thing for the hump in the wall over here, which I'll get to in a second too. But yeah, so we were like working on all that stuff. So yeah, we went out on Friday, did that, went to go eat and everything. But see, I think this is weird. But I mean, I don't know. I don't know about the color. I mean, I think it would work. Because it doesn't look the same on camera. But see, on camera it looks more gray. It might be the Bianca, the Ferrero Bianca. That's quartz. Might be that one, maybe that. What was it called again? Yeah, but it was like a really weird. Like it wasn't a. up a couple things I forget what it was now at the top of my head maybe not maybe we just went and got coffee I think we just went and got coffee and stuff so we started on the kitchen so I started working on getting this mess fixed which we have a lot of it kind of smoothed out now now I'm feeling it, it actually feels pretty nice it's a little bit of a lump right here still but up here feels really good so we worked on that <laughs> And we got all the cabinets ripped out now. The dining, the dishwasher's ripped out. We did discover that we're gonna have an issue with the floor because we were just gonna go right over the floor. But we're gonna have an issue with the floor here. So because it, the vinyl is way too like thick, whatever that's on top of it. So we are gonna end up taking that out, which we did take it out underneath the stove area back here. We did find some water damage. We're hoping that it's not, like, it wasn't wet or anything, so we're hoping that, that it's not, like, a new lake or anything.
underneath it. It seems like it's flat underneath because like we can go underneath like in the basement and look up because I like, can see the floor. So it looks like it's okay. But we're going to kind of like, once we take out the sink area, we can't take out the sink yet because we need it. But we did unhook some of the lines and then as we were taking out this side of the cabinet, which is why that whole counter countertop is still there. But when we took out all this side, um, we discovered there was a crack in the metal pipe there where the, like, the P-trap is at. It's probably because it's been rotted because it's old. So we went ahead and had to buy new stuff of that too. So, I mean, this is, <laughs> and I'll try, like, I don't know how I'm going to do this video, but like this has been, we, we've got a lot done, but it's been like kind of a pain in some parts. Cause like, I don't know if you can see over here, I punched a hole in the wall by accident over there. So I have to fix that. Um, that one there, they had a board going across where that countertop laid against or like rested against cause the ca the cabinets that were underneath there are really weird. They weren't like cabinets that are now, like that are out now. So I think we you'll see it in the video, but they're like rounded in the back instead of being like square into the corner like the new ones are. So I don't know really the deal, <laughs> like I guess, you know, 1970s. So um, there was a board going across, but we couldn't get the countertop because they glued the countertop together going across. We couldn't get it apart. So... I was like, let me try to take off this board. I can get the board off. So then when I was trying to like wiggle it off, it like punched a hole right in the wall. And I'm like, of course. So I think when we're doing all that is when, like I think the rotted, the rotted um, pipe thing was always an issue. And I think it's been leaking because you can kind of tell it's like it's been leaking for a while down there, which I don't know if that's the damage that was happening with the rest of the floor. If they had a water leak at one point and they fixed it, like I don't know the whole, you know, we don't know. So, um, but you can tell, like, I'm pretty sure that the thing, the pipe had been rotted. And then maybe as we were jiggling it all around, it kind of just knocked the rest of it loose. And so we went to go use the water, which is like pouring out of it. <laughs> so we had to go down. We had to go down twice. <laughs> Because we went down and bought a new metal one, or new plastic one, and we got it home, opened it up, and there's a crack in the same exact spot. So <laughs> we were like, okay, we're going back to the store. So we went back to the store, bought the more, like a more expensive one. So that seems to be working now. Um, but yeah, so I think that's kind of where we're at. And so I need to finish doing some more smoothing on this thing here to get the hump kind of out of it. Um, because like the drywall with the two pieces met, because I think there used to be a window here at one point, which I would love to have back, but we just didn't want to go through all the trouble of putting a new window in. Um, but anyway, so maybe at some point in time, like later, we can, we'll think about putting a window back in here. Because I would like to have a window here because that's what the sink will be at, but. Oh, another thing. So on Friday night, we went to, sell, we went to the hardwood store and we changed, it kind of changed our mind again on the on the countertop because Rudy wasn't really into the other countertop. We did find one here in town, so it is this Cafe Azul, which you can't really tell because of lighting issues, but there it is, kind of a little bit. Um, it is a little bit more gray with some brown, and it looked a little bit, it looked a little more like real stone. 
And we had looked at it before and I wasn't really a big fan of it. And then we went back, we were looking at it again and I was like, you know, really it's not that bad. Like I pulled the whole sheet out, like one of the big tall ones and I was like, yeah, I'm like, it's really not that bad. Like I kind of like it. So we were talking about it and it just sort of be cheaper to get it here. It, and we actually, because they have the cabinets, that's where we bought our cabinets at. So we were able to lay it like a piece of the, the filler piece for the, between the cabinets that you can buy if you're like cabinets are too short or whatever. Uh, so we laid a piece of that on top of it and it looked really good, which you guys will see in the video because we did that on Friday. So, so today I need to get video edited. Silly me, I don't know what happened, but I deleted last week's weekend vlog because <laughs> it was on this this uh, cartridge, this um, SD card here, and I thought I had uploaded it. I guess I hadn't. I deleted it. So unfortunately, you don't get to see last week's weekend vlog. So I'm so sorry about that. But again, the weekend vlogs may not be a, a normal thing, anyways. They're just whenever we're doing stuff, and you know, like last week we went out to we went to uh, Wichita and went shopping at a few stores, and I ended up getting. Um, I got a new Polaroid camera, which I had talked about, and like you saw me buy and everything. But of course. I got deleted so you can see it but yeah so but I just wanted to fill you guys in because I haven't been talking at all on the vlog so I just wanted to fill you guys in what was going on in the kitchen here we're kind of tore up our stuff but this thing is really neat like it's sandpaper on a vacuum so it's really cool but we did that we vacuumed all of this down actually the, the hump came out really nice we I kind of ran over it a little bit like there's some spots where it was kind of like it just had like a weird patch in it um, I finished just doing that and then we patched up a bunch of holes over here and then we have to wipe down the walls and once it dries we're gonna go over it again with the vacuum hose thing and and then wipe down the walls and then we should be good to paint. This is kind of where we're leaving off at, at this point. Sorry, the floor is really squeaky. I tried to, we tried to set it up as best as possible for us to use for a little bit. Um, Rudy said he's gonna try to start painting tomorrow. And then if I jump in, I'll probably start helping too. But when he gets off work, he says he's gonna start working on it. So, this is holding our food right here. Spices and stuff are right here and you know, put the stove and everything. We got all the walls washed and sanded. And we're just making fun of me. And then, yeah, I mean, I don't know. It's good in there. So that's it for this vlog. So I hope you guys like what you saw. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Follow me on all, you should do it for me. If you're watching, if you like what you saw, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Follow me on all my social medias listed down below. And until next time, don't forget to always be you. Bye.